A carjacking and high-speed chase through the Pisgah National Forest ended with a suspect shot and killed. It all started with a carjacking on Brookshire Road in Lenore and ended with a crash in Avery County. Channel 9 State Fairty breaks down the chase and the shootout. Well, if you look behind me, you can see the dirt road that this chase went on in a very remote area of Caldwell County before it crossed over into Avery County. The chase started after deputies say they spotted a car they believe was stolen at gunpoint near Lenore. You can see some of the rugged roads the pursuit went on at a very high speed through portions of the Pisgah National Forest. At one point, the suspect crashed into a woman's car near the town of Mortimer, right next to Betsy's old country store. He came from from that away and has run about 75 mile an hour and uh, it was real, real dangerous. I can say it was I've never seen anything like it in the 30 years I've been here. The driver didn't stop heading deeper into the national forest on roads that are difficult for even two cars to pass. You can see an area where a large section of the road was washed out. The sheriff deputy says somehow the driver managed to navigate the narrow gravel covered road before crashing a short distance away. Moments later, eyewitnesses described hearing between seven and eight shots fired. Deputies say the driver, Courtney Price, who they say failed to follow the deputy's commands, died at the scene. This teenager was camping with friends and was mountain biking along the road when the chase went by him shortly before the driver crashed. You'd never expect it to be just going by. It was middle of nowhere. Crazy. And the SBI has been called in to assist with this investigation. We were told by deputies earlier today that when they went to search the vehicle, they did find a handgun nearby. Back to you.